All right guys, so today I'm going to show you guys how to change the oil on this Mercury four stroke. Um, that's required for the one year maintenance. I'm doing this on my Ranger 185. It's got the Mercury four stroke 150. And yeah. So I'm gonna be using this chest mount so I can be hands free. Um, yeah, and we'll go over what um, what tools we need, and we'll get started. First thing that you're gonna want want to get is this Mercury um, one year maintenance kit. It's got six quarts of 10W30 Mercury four stroke oil. It's got this uh, this tube that will help you uh, help it drain into your drainage and then also an oil filter so this kit is cool because it's got everything you need it comes with instructions you're gonna need a 12 millimeter and a 16 millimeter or a 7 16 or a 5 8 and then you'll probably want some kind of napkin or cloth and an empty container to empty out your oil into so that you can take it to the uh, recycling center. All right, oil change procedure. Tilt the outboard out up past vertical for approximately one minute to allow any trapped oil to drain back into the oil sump. Past vertical. Let that drain for one minute. We're gonna go to vertical. Then let's Let's take this cowling off. All right, cowling is off. Put that in a safe spot. For kicks, let's, let's check this oil. Let's see, yeah, pretty low, pretty dark. Definitely needs an oil change. Next step, use a 16 millimeter 5 8 rinse to loosen the oil drain valve and be careful not to open the valve too far allowing oil to drain okay that's loosened id drain hose valve position the opposite end of the hose into an appropriate container okay we got our drain hose all right now it fits over just like that we got flow all right that is about done draining Set this guy right here to be cleaned up later. Tightened. Okay, next step. All right, changing the oil filter. Remove the plug from the oil trough and attach a 12 millimeter drain hose to the fitting. Position the opposite end of the hose into an appropriate container. Right. Here's the drain plug. Don't lose that. Get our drain hose back. Get that guy on there securely. Unscrew the oil filter by turning the filter to the left. Wow, that's tight. All right, guys, so that was pretty tricky getting it off. Um, I ended up having to ask my neighbor for help, and we used a leather belt to wrap it around there and screw it off. But now it's off. Unscrew the oil filter to the left. Allow oil to drain. Okay, so we're going to pour this oil in here. <laughs> Take that off. Yeah. Work it around, you cinch it up more so it gets nice and tight, and then you pull it. Right. And to install this oil filter, you're gonna need a little bit of grease. A little bit of grease right there. Grease up your seal. It's important to grease up the seal so that it comes off easier next time. Install that. It only needs to be hand tight. It's 
it's not gonna fall off. So we'll get that as tight as we can with our hand. Thank you.